Hey guys, Zex Romney here today, bringing you guys another gameplay slash commentary on YouTube. And today, for you guys, I have another episode of Black Ops 2, best class setup, so I do hope you enjoy it. And the gun I'm featuring today is the Vector K set. K10 submachine gun. I'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce it. But anyway, this gun is a really, really good weapon. Um, obviously, I'll go into more detail on it in a second. But anyway, the gameplay behind is a double spawn gameplay on that raid on 6v6 domination. And we do actually draw this gameplay, which is pretty funny because I think they captured a flag in the last 10 seconds, I think it was. And then in like the last second, the um, they got a draw against us. So it's pretty unfortunate. But then again, at least I didn't lose. So I don't like uploading gameplays where I lose. So I do hope you enjoy the gameplay anyway. And the attachments I'm using today on the Vector are extended mag, the extended clip attachment, and the long barrel attachment. And I am using the long barrel just because, as I said earlier in the earliest video, um, it inc increases the uh, range. I was about to say damage, but it increases the range. And the Vector hasn't got the best damage and range. I think the damage is okay. I wouldn't like complain about it. I think I still think it's good, but it's not as good as what it is on the, um, a lot of the other submachine guns. And the range isn't that good either. But the um, long barrel attachment increases the range. And then um, I like having some. Well, it, all my guns. I like having at least 40 bullets or around 40 bullets on my clip. Um, and it has about 32 of that extended clip. So that's why I'm using extended clip as 48. I think. Um, I think it's 48, and it's really good with extended clip. Extended clip and long barrel makes this gun an absolute animal, and it's got very, um, it's got a minimum amount of recoil. Literally, the recoil is there's none of it really. There is a tiny bit of recoil, but it's really easy to handle, and it's just a really good submachine gun at close range, and you can use it long range. So overall, it's a very good weapon. And anyway, let's get into the perks. Um, the perks are actually exactly the same as um, earlier's class setup, and as you know, it's perk one greed with hardliner flat jacket perk 2 greed with scavenger and toughness and then i have c4 on and anyway that's actually the class setup and as i said i was going to talk about about the um call, uh, call of duty ghost multi pro reveal and as i said I'll, the moab i think is coming back i know a few people mentioned it and i've seen it on videos and yeah i don't think i'm not sure if it does exactly the same thing but it does something and it's going to be a high kill streak so um, I don't don't quote me on it. I'm pretty sure it's coming back. People made videos and I'm pretty sure of that. And um, yeah, that's really really good. Um, that's gonna make the fun game much funner for me. And YouTube wise, it'll be quite fun to watch. Um, loads of people getting their triple, whatever it's gonna be called. And all that. I'm not sure if it's gonna be the call of the Moab or not. And also specialist is back, so that means that obviously people will be using that to get the Moab or whatever it's gonna be called. And um, as I said um, in one of my videos, I really wanted specialist to be put back into it and the Moab or some kind nuke Moab, one of the two things. And yeah, both of them are actually coming back, which is absolutely awesome. It makes the game so much funner to me for me. And uh, obviously, it'll probably I reckon uh, Call of Duty Ghost will last longer and people won't get as bored of it as quickly as what Black Ops 2 did for a lot of people. And I'm actually finding Black Ops 2 funner now, which is pretty strange because most people are finding it more annoying and annoying as it goes on. But And then there's a cool gamer called Search and Rescue. I'm not 100% sure on what that is. If it's like uh, Kill Confirmed, but it's something like you got to help team uh, confirm teammates tags when they die and something like that and there's another game mode like team deathmatch but you blow up after 30 seconds if you don't get a kill which um obviously prevents camping unless you just don't care about like getting blown up but that prevents camping which is really cool and that sounds like a really cool game mode that i'll probably play quite a lot um because it's probably going to be quite a fast action paced game mode as you blow up after 30 seconds of not getting a kill and yeah, that's that's that. Um, if you did enjoy the vis video, it is actually coming up to an end. So remember to leave a like and a comment, and please can we try and smash 40 likes, please, in this video. And remember, let me make sure to let me know what you thought of the multiplayer reveal. Personally, I thought it looks epic, and I'm really buzzing to get the game and play it. But make sure to let me know what you think in the comment section below. But anyway, guys, hope you all enjoyed the video, and I hope you all have a nice day. Peace.